Hello everybody and welcome to another ball review this uh, time for the barbecue ball, the barbecue bundle, a very tasty looking ball. I mean, you know, I tried, to <laughs> I tried to make a joke, that was just terrible, I apologize for that. But it's the barbecue ball and we're gonna take a look at my thoughts about this ball. Before we do that, make sure that you do hit the thumbs up button on the video. Also subscribe to the channel and turn on the notification. For those of you that do want to take the next step in there in your game, you go to patreon.com slash golf clash Tommy and sign up to any of our packages. You can start as low as two dollars and fifty cent. Alright Roast up with the all new barbecue ball. A scorching legendary power will help you blaze across the course. Power 5, side spin 2, and wind resistance 4. And for those with a very good eye, this is a ball that do have the same stats that we have had on several balls before. We have the Ryder Cup balls, we do have the Supernova, we do have the Rockies ball, um, might be even something else that I do forget but there is a lot of balls that way and this is definitely a ball that is a must to have in your inventory if you're playing expert and master in pro nah I don't really see that as a necessary thing and that's the same as a rookie and I'm thinking then mainly from a tournament perspective because this is a ball that will come handy when we do need to play um I li like we're playing a long par 5 but we don't want to play with a win 3 ball or a win 2 ball or win 1 we do want to have that a little bit extra wind resistance to help ourselves out on the second shot so my rating is the following we do have 7.5 out of 10 for tournament and I base that on that this is a ball that is not entirely situational or every ball to a degree is a situational ball but this is a ball that is towards the general side of um, the general side but it's more towards the long holes part fours part fives we're not going to use this ball on a part three etc and we also only have a plus two overpower needle stability and this is a ball that will be used in an overpower situation at least that is my belief that it will be uh, be done like that many of the times so therefore i settled with seven and a half out of ten the same uh, rating i gave the rocky ball a little while back so if you do not have like as a tournament player if you do not have a ball type like this with power of five side spin to win four you need to get some but if you do have already like for an example i have the the Ryder Cup balls I do have the I don't have many supernovas which is the reason I got 40 but I didn't get anything on my other two accounts because I do have the supernovas and I do have the Rockets ball to compensate as well if I would need so uh, when it comes to tour play this is not a ball that I would suggest using tour play I mean you can do that but it will come in you will get yourself into a problem many of the times when it comes to par threes because it's not really a, a, like a par five ball is not really how we have built the way we're playing the par threes that might change in the future i don't know but it i mean in some extent it could be a valuable ball in tour play but many of the times it will be a waste and you should play with another ball instead in my opinion let's take a look at the needle speed and the ball centering in action this ball is round and also the the needle is uh, is decent i mean it's a plus two so it's not the best but it's not the worst either and that's definitely an okay one to play in overpower this is master division practice and uh, that i'm using it in which is the same needle speed we do have on tour number and I would love to hear your thoughts about the barbecue ball and your rating. Have in mind that I rate all the balls from a general perspective. So that's why you can see some of the ratings be like a little bit weird when it is situational balls and stuff like that. But that's because it's general. Let me know in the comment section below. No opinion is a bad opinion is what I used to say. And I'm looking forward to read yours. Thank you so much for watching this ball review. And I wish you the best of luck in your Golf Clash game.